What's going on guys? Nick Hellman here, aka the Crypto Hitman, and this is a patreon.com slash learn crypto first official video. We're going over three meme coins that I think are vastly undervalued and that we already have entries into, but I wanted to also provide more information for those who've already bought the coins and those of you who have not yet heard of these at the opportunity that they may present. Now I'm not going to be here and say 1000x buy right now. We're going to take a look at the charts. We're going to see where some good entries may be and see if you can get involved. And if you want to stop missing out on the early entries, then join us at patreon.com slash learn crypto. Get access to myself, Todd Butterfield, and a thriving learn crypto community. So the first one here is Dubcat. If you know me, I don't ever give Solana meme coins. I don't think I've ever posted a single Solana meme coin in Patreon, on the YouTube, on the TikTok, no official calls. Well, we're giving one now. This is called Dubcat. This is a CTO by BitShaman in the Gem Hunter group. The Gem Hunter group has been here now for a couple cycles. BitShaman has done very well in the space. And what do I like about meme coins? I like the community and I like individuals that are involved that are not poor, they are rich. Now, what do I mean by that? That means they're not going to cheat out if this thing does a 2 or 3 or 5x. They are looking to go big or go home. They are looking to create the next Shiba Inu on Solana chain. Now, it is sitting here at 395,000 market cap. My private group got a buy down here on the dip. I think we were at like 200, 250,000 market cap, already up 81%. We broke out of this ascending triangle. The measured move for the price target would be slightly higher. Now, should you FOMO in right here, right now? Well, if you're in it for more of the mid to long term, you don't care about some 10, 20, 30% volatility, then sure, why not? Because I think that Dubcat will get to one. Five, potentially even ten million dollar market cap we'll talk a little bit about their process and a little bit about what they have planned but from a technical perspective we see the breakout here probably heads a little higher if we are supremely bullish and they enact some marketing and some new team members then it could continue and consolidate at much higher levels if the market or solana wants to pull back this lp gets dragged on and a whale wants to sell out like a jeep then you would want to be a big all-in buyer here on the retest of the breakout level right around 3,200. So keep that in mind. Dubcat, once they receive 500K market capitalization, that's where the next roadmap goal goes. That's when the marketing begins. That's when the KOL push begins. And that's when the real fun begins. So I think there's tons of upside here in Dubcat. Also, they've already survived for about eight days. In Solana, if you survive one week without rugging, you're the top 1%. Now, to get to the top 0.1%, you need to achieve 5 million market cap or higher. This one has a great chance of doing that. Another project is Mellow Man. I just started talking about it. Put the first tweet out after this buy. Mellow Man interests me a lot. This is the Matt Fury kind of ecosystem. You got Wolf on here. You got Pepe on here. You got Brett on here. And now you have Mellow Man. The private group did get a buy on this dip all the way down here. We're currently up. What is the math on that? I don't even know. 56 percent you see i do have some resistance lines here one at 3000 one at 4250 now i do think that mellow man they're releasing some new products today a new bot today they're trying to get trending so they have a lot of upside potential and if mellow man doesn't go to a new all-time high at some point i would be extremely shocked you saw here this well, this was the dev cheating out community takeover explosion to the upside now we're having a healthy consolidation we are testing these resistance levels. We are testing these resistance levels. Again, you're going to have resistance at 3,000. You're going to have resistance at 4,250. But if we don't go to a new all-time high, I will be absolutely shocked. Sitting here at $1.7 million market cap on the Ethereum network, which is hot right now because the ETH ETF is supposed to be beginning within the next week. So Mellow Man is one I like. You may get some volatility, but anywhere down here, I don't see a problem with it. You're in between the original 786 and the 618 zones in this consolidation page. We've had some minor breakouts already. This thing can move fast. This thing will move fast upon the launch of the products. And the first product is supposed to be launching today. So we'll see if that happens. Shout out to everybody who's already up 56%. But we got much higher objectives to go. And the last one I'll talk about briefly is Frank. This is kind of the forgotten farmer over on base chain. Uh, we've taken a couple trades out of this, and the reason that I'm not afraid of showing my trade here, even if Frank Team sees it, is they're actually incentivizing trading. 
by buying and selling Frank, you earn farming points in which you get dropped, airdrop other meme coins. We've earned a plethora of other meme coins, including Carlo, which did very well. We earned hundreds and thousands of dollars worth of Carlo by trading Frank. Now, what am I saying down here? Frank is telling me they're going to have some big news by the end of July. Base chain now has on-chain summer getting pushed by Coinbase. We're sitting at 194,000 market cap. A team is still active after launching May 10th. So launching over two months ago, still active. If they find the narrative again, or they have big news that is going to get the catalyst and the, the community revitalized, you're sitting at a very small market cap, lock liquidity, very easy to push this. You're getting benefited by buying in farming points. And also you can stake your franc you can stake your franc to earn passive income in Ethereum based off of the trading volume. Now, the trading volume is low here, but I've been accumulating in this range, staking for ETH, and I'm telling you, the Ethereum is building up nicely over there. When this thing makes a turnaround, it could be quick and rapid, and you'll benefit on two, two, two ways. Price go higher, but also the more volume, the more passive income. Farmer Frank has amazing memes over there. They have real utility. I'm excited to see what the news is leading to the end of July. See if they can catch fire again. And if this thing can't break the all-time highs, that would be a shame. Because I think the all-time highs are only 2 million. And I'm saying only 2 million, but only 2 million is a 10x from here, not including the potential passive income. So take a look for the contract addresses in the description wherever you're watching this. Dubcat Community Takeover about to start melting faces beyond 500k market cap. Mellow, yes, 1.7 million, the biggest one, but overhead resistances are higher. I would be shocked if it doesn't go to the new all-time high. And Frank is kind of the wild card here. But you can accumulate in this range, stake for passive income, and let's see what the news is in July and see if that's enough to spark the next wave of glory to new all-time highs, which is a 2 million market cap, which would be a 10x from here on this tiny base chain meme coin. That's it for now. Crypto Hitman, join us. Patreon.com slash learn crypto. I just gave you three meme coins that all three were up in the, the, the private group that I have. All three are on different networks, so there has to be one that you can get involved with. And none of these are paid shills, folks. None of these are paid shills. We are here to give you the alpha. We're, we got our ear to the, 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 the road, trying to find the alpha, trying to get connections with some of these team members. And these are the ones I like. Peace.